But you're going off the liquor. Hear that? You're going to straighten yourself out, and I'm going to help you. Yes, I am. I'd make you a better wife than one of them society dames. And someday, I'm going to make you love me. Ain't I, Jerry? Someday, I'm going to make you love me. Well, you haven't told me yet how you come to hook this wealthy fish. No, I didn't hook him, Maisie. It was his own idea. <laughs> I'd like to get some guy drunk enough to want to marry me. You know, Maisie, I'm afraid I fell for this guy. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. I'll get a run in my stocking. I'm not kidding. Well, I'd have gone for him if they didn't have a dime. Hello, honey. Hello, Jerry. Oh, Jerry, this is Maisie. Hello. How do you do? Uh, I was pretty well slacked last night. Yeah. When you started to see those pink elephants, I thought I'd have to call for an animal trainer. <laughs> you're a nice girl. And I'm terribly relieved. Now, you're going to look at matters sensibly, aren't you? What are you driving at, Jerry? Well, any settlement you want will be made, of course. And the divorce will be arranged quietly. Well, I don't want a divorce. Oh, look. I know this was all my fault. And I'm sorry. Oh, but listen, Jerry. I can't say it the way I should, maybe, but I'm in love with you. Now, be reasonable. This was a gin marriage. Well, you were ginned up, but I wasn't. <laughs> I know. And I've got the morning after headache. I'm willing to pay for it liberally. Now, that seems fair to me. It would be if I was in that business, but I'm not. Can't you see, Jerry? I love you. Smarter than I thought. More in it for you being Mrs. Jerry Seavers, huh? Well, it won't work. Listen, I married you straight and square. You can't laugh that off. No, but a good lawyer can. Now, you take my advice and accept a nice, big, generous settlement. But I don't want a settlement. Now, look, monkey. There's no reason for you and me quarreling. Here's a couple of hundred. And here's my lawyer's card. <laughs> 